equation of value so we'll be doing this material question question is here and the, i'll show you the working from here so an investor is to pay 80000 for a property the investor will then be entitled to receive rental payments at the end of each year for 99 years the rental payment will be fixed for the first 33 years increasing to double the original amount for the next 33 years and three times the original amount for the remaining 33 years the value of the property at the end of the 99 years is expected to be 150 to 1500000 calculate the amount of the rent payable in the first year that the investor expects to obtain a return of 8% per annum effective on the purchase so first we'll open a new word document okay so this is my word document in which i'll write so first question 1 this is my question 1 and we have to write the equation of value let the amount of rent be x okay so therefore equation of value all t equals to 80000 is equal to x and then we write a33 remember for a33 we have written control all shift b So this is all shift B, which is there, and you just change it to A thirty three. Plus next is two X V to the power thirty three, and then again A thirty three. So please do not write again and again. Just copy and paste. Okay, once you've copied, now it will remain, and then three X V to the power sixty six, and again. Control V A thirty three, okay. And last he is getting a redemption, so plus one fifteen hundred thousand V to the power ninety nine, okay. So V to the power ninety nine needs to be here. Space. So this is the val equation of value. Next line you can come and write all t equals to eighty thousand. Is equal to x. You can take common, which is one. Then plus two v to the power thirty three plus three v to the power sixty six. Brackets close. Control v, which is a thirty three, and then fifteen hundred thousand v to the power ninety nine. Okay, space. And now putting the values, all t equals to eighty thousand is equals to x into One plus two into one point zero eight to the power minus thirty three. This has to be point, okay? One point zero eight to the power minus thirty three plus three into one point zero eight to the power minus sixty six. Just write to the power minus sixty six, and then for the value of a bar thirty three, which is equals to eleven point five one three nine, and plus fifteen hundred thousand into one point zero eight to the power minus ninety nine. Okay, and rearranging and so on. This implies x is equals to eighty thousand minus. Seven thirty six point four 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 divided by thirteen point five four five, which is equals to five eight five two. Okay, so this is how you write the first sum. For the next one, let's see what is the next sum we have. So the next sum is a investor deposits two thousand into an account and then withdraws level annual payment starting one year after the deposit is made. Immediately after the eleventh withdrawal, investor has four hundred left in the account. Calculate the amount of each withdrawal given that the effective annual rate of interest is eight percent. So let's see. This is also a material question. This is a very short question. You can see, and this is also the same type we'll do is. So question two. Again, control enter. Remember, every time you have to come to a new sheet to write your answer. Okay, let x be the amount of withdrawal. so these are certain things which you need to type 
then therefore equation of value is alt equals to 2000 is equals to x again control alt shift b this u this n needs to change to 11 plus 400 v to the power 11 and then so alt equals to 2000 is equal to 7.1390 x plus 400 into 1.08 to the power minus 11 okay so therefore solving x is equal to 1828.45 divided by 7.1390 which is equals to 256.12 okay so this is how you solve equation of you all increasing decreasing accurately is equation of value the main things are these terms which you can see are already saved in my shortcuts and which I can use directly in the shortcuts and it will be saved till the exam. Only thing is as you're saving your shortcuts, keep on writing them in a copy so that you remember. Okay, as if you practice, you will remember which shortcut is where. As I have done, I already remember, but then you will also remember. Okay, thank you.